time to liberate some things we need. For la revolución, of course. I'll send you what you need to know in order to perform this small service for Jose. Welcome, señor. Welcome to the Isla Grande. Never seen a girl in a bathing suit, schmuck? Sure, but not usually with an attitude. Hey, <laughs> come on, Rico. It's briefing time. Things are shaping up nice. Your new friend Carmona's already given us some nice intel. So, now we're gonna do a little surgery on the military. And guess who's the surgeon? Meet General Jose Durango, Mendoza's fixer. Kill him. We break the back of the army. Durango has one weakness. Girls. Every night he leaves his base and travels in an armored convoy to the top of the old volcano and gives another poor hooker a night to remember or forget. Guy's got clockwork balls, but Tonight's gonna be the last playtime. Hell fire! That son of a bitch Durango's got the lowdown on our little regime change scheme, and he's gonna show it to El Presidente. If you wanna live, kill Durango. Durango's gonna split any minute. You better haul your ass to the army base. Jeez, Rico, they're already leaving. Take the general out. Double quick. Careful, you're gonna... Hey, Rico! Here come the bad guys! Fire! Take him out! Okay, get moving! Manos arriba! Sorry to break it to you, buddy, but it turns out Durango wasn't in the limo. Guess he's already enjoying himself at the El Volcan Horror! Go there now and put him out of his misery. Senor, there must be a mistake. Please, do not hurt me. I am too young to die. Oh, God, no! These weapons, they're just so powerful, don't you think? Hijo de puta! No such thing as safe sex anymore. Ain't that right, Durango? Of 
Stirred up one gigundo hornet's nest, Rico. The police and the army are arresting anything that moves. We must stand together, strong, one thing's for sure Mendoza's rattled. So, now we're gonna throw a bone to the gorillas. Esperanza's done a deal with some gun runners. She's put a down payment on some hardware that the gorillas think will win them the country. And you're gonna hold her hand to make sure nothing goes wrong. Why? Because Uncle Sam's putting up the cash. That's why. Your job is to keep Esperanza alive and make sure it's the good guys that get the money and the guns. Your rental delivery. Please note there are no scratches or dents. Any damage is coming out of your ass. Ah, what a sense of humor, huh, Rico? Don't you just love her? One million dollars in used notes. A small price to pay for a revolucion, que no? Depends who's paying. Ha! Let's go. My apologies. Here's the deal. We walk into the gorge, just the two of us. There will be two trucks. We give them the case, they give us the trucks. We drive the trucks away. End of story. So, vámonos! So nice to do business with you, Esperanza. As always. May I? Count it if you wish. Please, where would we be without trust? You have the launchers? Sam 3's, still in their wrappers. On the trucks. May I? Of course. Enjoy. Shoot him! That double-faced bastard double-crossed us before we had a chance to double-cross him! Take him out! Double-quick! Hope you guys brought your earplugs. The hero returns. Gave Esperanza a lift home, huh? And some of that Rico magic. Guy's gotta grab his R and R when it's offered. Now listen up. This river is the Cocodrilo Perezoso. The Montano cartel uses it to ship out the coke. We've got intel. There's a special delivery due this morning. Head up river, Rico. Check out the key and uh, work out what's going down. Then get the hell out. There's your transport. Rico, 
be a load of nitro, rocket fuel, courtesy of those nice terrorist bastards, the Black Hand. Black Hand? What the heck are they doing there? Shit, you don't get that stuff in Radio Shack. Somebody somewhere is planning to make themselves some missiles. Destroy it, Rico. <laughs> the lines, Rico! What kept you? There's a tuna to gut and some sweet potatoes to peel. Thought we might have a barbecue tonight. What do you think? Hey, don't let me spoil the party. My treat. Hey, Kane, we should break out some of that pineapple sorbet. Why not? Regime change really works up an appetite. Don't you agree, Rico? Thank you for coming, my friend. My husband meets today with some very big money people. We have become, it seems, a hot investment. Come here, and I'll show you this little job we have for you. I bet you win. We need to impress the money people just how serious we Riojas are. This is the largest coca field of the Montanos. If this were to disappear, it would be so, so bad for them. All that lost coca, all that lost money, and then the paranoia, hmm? They will wonder, who is so powerful that they can do this? And that would be me? Yes. Watch what you're doing, huh?
Contact now. So sad to see you drinking alone. <laughs> Greetings, my friend. Disappointed that my lovely wife isn't here? She's so very sweet. Hmm? Yeah, she's got a great personality. <laughs> Word of your little adventure to the coca fields has traveled fast. <laughs> Let's celebrate this great partnership of ours, eh? <laughs> Garamikas and the rebels will move against Nuevo Estocolmo soon. And their destination? The broadcast center. Garamikas will send word out that it's time to rise up against El Presidente. So, your job is to buy the guerrillas enough time to broadcast that speech before the shit hits the fan. Get moving, Rico. It's good to see you, old friend. Keep the army bastards away until I finish my speech to the people. Comrade, the studio is this way. Inside the studio. His speech should be over in about two minutes. Hostiles headed for the seaside entrance, Rico. Rico. On this, the eve of the great uprising. Tonight is a night you will never forget. 
This broadcast marks the beginning of a new era! Let's go, Ese. Viva la revolución. Alto, policía. Stop right there! 